Okay, we are at a familiar launch here. Man, last time I was here, I was getting over a really bad cold, and it was horrible. And yeah, man, whoo, here we go. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Welcome to Lucky and Blessed Fishing. We are getting ready to go out here. It's taken me like an hour to launch. My cable for my motor got pulled out of the plug while I was uh, putting the battery on. I pulled the line too hard, and I need to fix that and just run a new line. Anyways, just fix that and we're going to go out. We went out uh, here for uh, pickerel uh, and caught some rockfish. And we did a family trip out of here, Stony Creek Marina. And we're going to go the other way today and uh, look for some rockfish. So once again, my fish finder's out. So uh, I don't know what's happening. New battery, new battery box and didn't test it before I came out. So I'm just going to look for the, look for the uh, bait fish and catch some rockfish. So here we go. Hanging to the left, heading out to the bay. Once again, the fish finder is not powering up. I have a new power source with a Dakota lithium box and battery that was charged up fully and uh, had to put new connectors on the, 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 the cables. I don't know, man. I really want to use this fish finder. <laughs> anyways just so last time I went out didn't have a fish finder I caught you know 10 fish I lost another two or three on top of that in like two and a half hours so I'm just looking for bait looking for birds looking for moving water looking for current looking for structure I got everything from a quarter with a three and a half which is over here just kind of dragging close to the boat to uh three-quarter with the bigger BKD uh, which is this one right here which I don't really need to hold on to <coughs> a little high but oh 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 and there goes the boat there goes the boat anyways I'm like in the channel now I'm thinking I should probably head over I don't I think I'm in the, uh, the channel <laughs> See if I can uh, do a little, might be some flats here. Probably some flats here. Really at this point, I'm just looking for bait. I'm not gonna go in if there's no bait moving. So other than that, it'd be good if we'll just find the edge of the channel, which I don't know how to do that without a fish finder guess uh, I could just keep going until this deeper one starts dragging then kick back in <laughs> anyway so we're heading out we're just passing the bridge here uh, super late start it's 2 30 I mean I, it was gonna be an afternoon start anyways just plan on coming out and fishing for a few ap ap a few hours this afternoon so we'll see what happens lucky and blessed fishing here we go Fish on already. <laughs> oh man. Fish on baby. Feels like a good one. Of course you know I say it feels like a good one all the time. 
literally just doesn't feel like a rockfish though. It might be a red. <gasps> oh my gosh. Nah, it's a rockfish. Ooh. Nice. Nice. Actually, could be a keeper. And we can get our fish and go home after the hours and hours it took me to get out here today. <laughs> oh. Yep, I think it's a keeper. Yep, oh yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. Yes, I think it's a keeper. Right out of the gate, baby. <laughs> Lucky and blessed, baby. There's the bridge right there. I was just getting stuff set up. <laughs> oh yeah, this is a keep. I know it's a keep. No, oh, it is a keep. Oh man. Well, that was exciting. I say, let me go in a little bit to find, see if I can find the edge. Poo! Found a fish. Okay, all right, bud. All right. He's, I'm going to say he's going to be uh, 19. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oh, he's heavy. 20. 20 and a quarter. You're coming home, buddy. Thank you. Thank you for feeding my family. <sighs> my granddaughter Zadie likes rockfish. Last last I brought them some. So beautiful baby. Beautiful baby. BKD. My favorite go-to at a three-quarter there. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> Come on. Yee. Yeehaw. Yeehaw, baby. That is awesome. That is freaking awesome, man. Woo! I know. I got you, buddy. I got you, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, I got you, buddy. I got you, buddy, but you're coming home, baby. You are coming home. Man. Oh, yeah. There we go. Nice new side there. There it is. All right, well, we're coming out of the uh, Stony Creek here. I think we're gonna pick something up coming right out. We already picked something up like right there. Coming up, coming under the, well, just past the bridge. First little flat area on the left. Bam, keeper. 20 inch plusser. So. Had to repair my wiring for the motor. Had to replace the batteries because once I did that, it still didn't work and I had to replace the batteries of my remote. Like, are you kidding me? Like everything possible was keeping, I mean, I'm totally MacGyver rigged on my motor. So I may be paddling back later. I do have my paddle, so I'm good. But uh, man, holy mackerel. Anyways, figured I'd just turn the cameras on as we come around this, uh, there's some structure here. I just, you know, have a good feeling. I probably what I should do is throw into the structure right here. Oh, there's a cool shot. There's the key bridge, which our goal is to head in that direction. See if there's any boats out here. Maybe do some jigging. All right, I just turned this off and I started seeing bait jumping. Well, that's a good sign. I think I'm going a little too slow though. I need to get my trolling speed up. So you can see in the background uh, a little bit of storm activity coming in and honestly I really wasn't paying as close of attention to it as I should have. And then I actually got a call from my daughter and she said, hey, check, watch out for those storms. So I immediately checked the weather and started hightailing it back and ended up having to beach the kayak. Uh, as the storm passed, took cover, and then I was able to actually go back out and fishing again. So, crazy, crazy day. Let's see 
if I can adjust my speed here. I feel like I'm still going a little slow. Come on, bird, show me the way here. The bird's sitting. Nobody's chasing or eating. Well, that looks like it might be some bait. Well, we got a fish on. Oh, we got some big waves coming in. I have a feeling that this is a new species on the day. Oh my goodness. It's a small fish. This one is... Do we have a fish on this one? Oh my gosh, there's a fish on this one. Or I'm stuck on a rock. No, I think I'm stuck on a rock. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. Alright. Oh, this is bad. Alright. I'm gonna have to spot lock us and see what happens. Oh! That's still out there. Oh, what is it? A little sea bass or something? What is that? Oh, a little perchy. That big perch, actually. What were you thinking, dude? Dude, nice perch. <laughs> oh, bro, what were you thinking? That was way more, way more uh, bait than you need. Yeah, we'll go back and get that one. He's on a rock. But hey, another fish, another species. It's a fish. That's a fat, oof, that is a fat, fat perchy. Not surprised. Okay, bro. Fat perchy. Oh! I know. I know. We'll get you right back. Oh, gosh, dude. Okay, there's one. Get that other one. Don't flip right now. There we go. Go ahead, bro. Go ahead. He's gonna be okay. He's gonna be okay. I don't even know how long we had him on there. But he liked this uh, Yozuri. <laughs> Are you cast in here? Since I had to beach the kayak, it definitely reduced my fishing time. So instead of driving towards the key bridge, I just hung at the mouth of the creek there and uh, just trolled back and forth, trying to figure out where the channel was. Then I ended up just casting in and throwing at this, uh, this rock corner here, which always is known to hold rockfish and perch. Okay, seagulls all but left.
cockpit. Oh, I just missed it. There we go. Got another perch. <laughs> and we're not recording, are we? Hey, we are. Hey, we let it go. Okay. Nice. Self release. I knew there'd be more perch in here. Why not catch some more fish? Yeah, I know. You're still there, Big Bubba. <laughs> 